Even during an unusual time when our routines are constantly changing, there's still one thing we all need, food. That's why I'm checking out these 10 grocery stores to see what steps they're taking to keep you safe. First up, Tom Thumb. You'll quickly notice these drive up and go signs in the parking lot. Once you do walk in, multiple employees with masks on are wiping down carts. And then anywhere with the counter, check out Bakery Deli, you'll see signs on the ground trying to keep everyone at a safe distance. Now to the three stores I visited with the most regulations, Central Market, Fiesta, Trader Joe's. All of these had social distancing outside, restricting the number of people in their stores at one time. Central Market easily had the most signs related to safety and social distancing. Heading down near Turtle Creek, you'll find this Target, which has some reserved drive up parking spots similar to Tom Thumb. Now, when you walk through this store, you won't find that many safety recommendations. Once you get to the food aisles, you'll see these signs limiting the number of items you can buy. And then when you get to the checkout lines, you'll see those social distancing signs at your feet. Neither Kroger nor Aldi had clear large signs about social distancing outside the stores. Aldi didn't have much social distancing from people coming in or out of the store. There wasn't any enforcement either. Now Walmart in West Dallas was probably the busiest business. There weren't many detailed signs, but there was a lot of blue tape six feet apart in the food aisles. So what about Sprouts? While there is someone wiping down carts at the front, there's no clear signs of social distancing until you read the fine print of some of the signs inside. There's also some food limitations and then blue tape on the ground near the counters. The nearby Whole Foods has a big sign here advertising its Amazon Prime delivery. There's also a security guard out front letting people know all carts have been sanitized. So out of all 10 grocery stores, every single one at least had social distancing at the registers. Some also have updated or changing guidelines starting in the next couple weeks. To view those changes, just head on over to WFAA.com. In Dallas, I'm Jay Wallace.